On the Democratic side, President Biden sailed to victory in every state that voted on Super Tuesday, getting at least 80 percent of the vote in many of them. However, he did face some opposition in some states in the form of a protest vote. Activists calling on voters to choose the uncommitted option to protest Biden's handling of the war in Gaza. In Minnesota, the uncommitted vote stood at 19 percent. Biden issuing a statement as Super Tuesday results were coming in, focusing on his likely challenger in November, former President Trump, saying, quote, Tonight's results leave the American people with a clear choice. Are we going to keep moving forward or will we allow Donald Trump to drag us backwards into the chaos, division and darkness that defined his term in office? Like Trump, Biden suffered one defeat on Tuesday night, losing the Democratic caucuses in the territory of American Samoa to entrepreneur Jason Palmer. Palmer earning 56% of the votes. However, the tally was small, with less than 100 votes between both candidates.